What's up guys, today I'm going to show you how to make this super beginner friendly phone hologram effect for completely free. Ah, uh, to be honest guys, a lot of people make it out to be a lot harder than it actually is. In reality, it's really easy, so let me show you how you can make the same effect. Let's go. Alright guys, so now we're in After Effects, I'm going to show you how to do this really quickly. So you need two things, first you need your clip with whoever's scrolling, in this case it's me with a mask on. Next you need your screen recorded footage. Now, I've already pulled mine up here. All I've done is I've screen recorded it on my iPhone, then what I've done is I've uploaded it, I don't know, to my Gmail or to WeTransfer. Somehow get it from your phone onto your PC and save the file. Now once the file is saved, bring it into After Effects and as you can see, the screen recording is clearly working. Now it's time to turn it into this cool hologram looking thing. All you got to do is make it into a 3D layer. I always add motion blur just in case. Now I'm going to rotate this round just like this, just so it kind of looks like it's facing towards me. Then I'm going to bring it over here, just kind of do a little nice line up, maybe size it down a bit by pressing S, bring it to about here. Just keep playing with the rotation eventually until you find something you like. So now once you've got that, it's time to lower the opacity a little bit just by dragging this down. Maybe just like that's fine. Now I'm going to add a deep glow just to make it a little bit nicer. So what you're going to do now is go onto P on your phone layer and press Alt on the stopwatch. You're going to see this little menu come up. That's fine. Type in wiggle until you see this. Click on that. And as you can see, when I press enter, we have two brackets. Now I'm going to use the digits 5 comma 5. And as a result, this is what we've got. A nice little wiggle. Now it's time to do the animation. Okay, so I slightly adjusted how it looks, but that's not a problem. I just did the rotation thing. Now that we've done the wiggle, all you need to do is make the animation. So you press P over here. Press a stopwatch icon to make a keyframe. Drag this one a bit more in front to just maybe somewhere around here. That's fine. Now grab your layer, use the arrow or just simply drag it up until it's out of frame. Now highlight these two keyframes, press F9 and now it's time for the graph editor. Once you're in the graph editor, I want you to highlight the right side and drag it to the left until you have something looking like this. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I flipped the rotation around just so you can see what I've been typing on the screen the entire time. So it's pretty simple. We've got a nice little wiggle animation the whole lot. So it's a lot simpler than people kind of make it look so yeah guys that's pretty much it hope you lot enjoyed it more importantly i hope you learned something make sure you apply everything you see in these videos and a bit more of a different tutorial than normal not our usual music video style but still something you can utilize in your music videos so have a good day night whatever's going on your sides and yeah that's pretty much it for me love